In this video, I will show you how to use Magic Design Canva. If you do have any questions or comments regarding this tutorial, feel free to drop that down in the comment section down below the video. And with that being said, let's jump straight into it. So here we are, as you can see on canva.com. Now, the first thing you're going to want to do from the canva.com homepage is come over to this menu on the left hand side and you want to click here onto Magic Studio. From here, if you just scroll down slightly, you're going to see the magic design here. So what you want to do is give that a click. Then what it's going to do is come up with a pop-up window. So all you want to do is press the purple Try Magic Design button here. And as you can see, it now will come up with a search box at the top and it says use five plus words to describe your design. So what you want to do is put a prompt similar to if you was using something like ChatGPT. So for example, you could put uh, birthday invitation with a picture of a clown designed for a... 21 year old man. Now this is a very brief description. You can of course put more words and things like that in, but all you wanna do is put that in and then press enter. So what's gonna happen, this is now gonna to get to work and as you can see, it's going to refresh the page and at the top, we've got the magic design category. So you can see that the AI is currently generating this and after a minute or two, we have some example designs. Now, as you can see, they're not brilliant because of course, this was just a very brief description to basically show you how this works. However, you can go ahead and use a much more descriptive pr prompt when you're using magic design. And then all you wanna do is select the one that you want to use. So let's say this one, for example, just go ahead and click on it and what you can then do is press the purple customize this template button and what it's going to do is load this up in Canva and then we can go ahead and further edit it using the Canva editor. So that's how to use Magic Design Canva. With that being said I hope this quick tutorial did help you out today and if this did help you out I would really appreciate it if you was to consider dropping down below the video, leaving a like and also subscribing to the channel. With that being said, I just want to take a minute to thank you guys for watching this quick tutorial and I will see you in the next video.